Hi everybody, happy Tuesday. I am back with another brand new book to share with you. And this book is Thank a Farmer. And this is a great summer book because this is such a great time to get fruits and veggies and all different kinds of things that are local and fresh. So are you ready to find out what this book is all about? Let's get started. And what do we see? We see something growing. How many of you out there have gardens? Thank a farmer. Potatoes. If you like the food on your table, thank a farmer. If you like bread for breakfast, thank a farmer. Combine sweeps, winter wheat, chop, kernels pop from chaff, plop into the hopper, rain into grain carts, and storage elevators for milling and grinding into flour. Thank a farmer for your bread, fresh and hearty. If you like your cereal with milk, thank a farmer. Dairy cows wear white, black, brown, milked by hand, squeeze, squirt, ping into the pail, or by machine, milk flows through the hose, ready for pickup. Thank a dairy farmer for your milk, smooth, and silky. If you like your summer salad and a variety of vegetables, thank a farmer for leaves and seeds. Stems and flowers, bulbs and tubers. See the potatoes? Fruits and roots. Thank a farmer for your fruits and veggies, nourishing and nutritious. What is your favorite veggie? What's your favorite fruit? If there are berries and cherries in your bowl, thank a farmer. Farm workers follow the sun and the seasons. Berries bloom on the vine, ripe for picking. Pinch, pluck, pull, fill the punnet. Machines help workers too. Tree shakers clamp the trunk. Upside down umbrella unfolds. Shake, shake, shake. Fruit falls down, then up the belt and into the bin. Fold in, begin again. Thank a farmer for your berries. Sweet and tangy. If you like peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, thank a farmer. Peanut pods grow underground. Did you know that? Diggers pull up plants, shake off soil, plants lie upside down to dry. Pickers peel off pods, pop into the hopper, vines lie in the fields. Peanuts dry and roast, grind into peanut butter. Thank a farmer for your peanut butter. Creamy and crunchy. What's your favorite, creamy or crunchy? Mine's crunchy. If you like rice for breakfast, lunch, or dinner, thank a farmer. Plow and flood the field. Soak seeds drop from fast flying planes. Heavy seeds sink and sprout. Drain fields to harvest. Combines cut and comb the stalk. Separate the kernel. Bank out wagons catch the grain. Rice is dried and stored. Thank a farmer for your wild rice too. Harvested by hand. Pullers propel the boat. Knockers bend the stalk over the hull. Tap, grains plonk, dry in the sun. Parch in a pot, thresh the chaff and winnow. Thank farmers for all kinds of rice, fluffy and filling. If you like mushrooms on your pizza, thank a farmer. Mushrooms grow in compost beds, stacked on shelves, add some spawn, place the peat moss up, pop, mushrooms, twist, push, turn, trim, pack, sort, ship, recycle, and begin again. Thank a farmer for your mushrooms, earthy and chewy. Who out there likes mushrooms? I'm not a big fan. If you like your sweaters and socks, thank a farmer. Spring is time for sharing fleece, buzz, slide, fleece glides, off, wash, card, spin some yarn. Thank a farmer for your winter wool, warm and cozy. We have a lot to thank farmers for, don't we? Clothing, food. Thank farmers in winter for your maple syrup too. Drill a hole, 
tap the spit, tap the spile, hang the bucket, cold nights, warm days, sap flows through rub, through rubber vines. Boiled until brown, smell cotton candy sweetness. Thank a farmer for your maple syrup, sugary and sticky. If you like your food fresh picked, thank a farmer for rooftop hives and honeybees, for hens and hoop houses, for hanging baskets full of fruit and vining vegetables, for shelves streaming with lettuce, for greens growing up. Hydro, aero, aquaponics. All these different ways to grow your food. Garden in a city lot or schoolyard plot, in planters boxes and backyard pots. Thank farmers everywhere for your fresh food and be one too. Farmers are thankful for their helpers. People planting and picking, animals carrying, growing, giving, machines plowing, planting, plucking, and harvesting. There's a lot of work that goes into this, isn't there? Farmers are thankful for Soil and sun, water and worms, birds and bats, for butterflies, bees, and even trees. If you like the food on your table, thank a farmer. And it looks like they're shopping at Farmer's Market. Did you go to Farmer's Market? The end. And at the very end of this book, there's a whole lot of information about everything we read in this book. And it's just a small survey of farming methods. So you definitely wanna come in and check out this book. And this will also count since we just started our Summer at RPL program. This is a book that was published in 2020, 2024. So check it out and mark your, mark your activities. I will be back on Thursday with another brand new book to share. So until then, everyone have a great couple days. Thank Farmer and let me know what you think about this book. Bye for now.